make lavender cookies. Hi everyone, my name is Lupita and welcome to the Cookie Couture, where flavor and design collide. If you like to try new recipes and new flavors, this cookie is super super nice. This cookie is super delicious and it's made with whole wheat flour and if you like, you can substitute the whole wheat with regular flour and it's made with dry lavender. So, I'm super excited to share this recipe with you and let's get started. These are the ingredients that you will need to prepare these delicious cookies. First, we need to make the lavender sugar. this lavender sugar it smells amazing okay so now we have our lavender sugar and we're gonna set it aside so let's watch and see how you can prepare this recipe <laughs> And this time I'm gonna make a super easy technique. I am going to make just a log and then we're gonna put it in the freezer and then we're gonna cut our cookies. So I have here a piece of parchment paper. I'm gonna put a little bit of whole wheat flour, just a little bit. And then I'm gonna take my beautiful cookie dough. Looks super nice, okay, so I'm gonna put it here. And then I'm going to 
form a love. Well, I'm gonna try to make it as nice as possible. It looks super nice because the little lavender pieces are there. And it's gonna look so cute. I bet that you are going to love this cookie recipe. Here we have our cookie look. So now we're gonna cover it with the parchment paper. Now it's ready to put it in the freezer and I'm gonna leave it there maybe like three hours or more so it is very very firm so I can cut up my cookies. Now I have my baking sheet ready and I'm ready to cut out those cookies. I will preheat my oven at 350 Fahrenheit degrees and I am going to use a very sharp knife and a tiny cookie cutter. And this is why your cookie dough needs to be super cold so you can easily cut out your cookies. Another thing that you can do is use a tiny cookie cutter and make a little flower in the center. I have my cookies ready to bake. Bye guys!